There we go. Yeah, I see some lights. I was about to say, but... Uh, yes. Yeah, scoot back a little bit, though. Because y'all are, like, way up in my grill. This goes out where? That's a stage. That's a stage. There's a, there, I think there's an exit over there somewhere. She said, I'm just trying to sneak out. I don't want to take another picture. All right. Yes, you are ready. Okay. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Joe Flash and I'm at my school. I barely just got out of the town show and we had some very special guests come on stage and I'm here with them right now. We got D and Chai. Hey, I'm Chima. What's up? I'm D. And together we are D and Chi. And I got some quick questions I wanted to interview you guys all real quick. So, first question, when did you guys start singing? Um, yeah, I, I would say, I mean, singing for life, like, came out, came out the womb singing, that's not weird to say. Um, <laughs> but I kind of started pursuing it, actually, here in Orlando High School, like, I was in the choir, and show choir, you know, did some drama stuff, yeah, sang the national anthem at, like, every game, that kind of thing. Yeah, I, I, I probably didn't sing in front of people until maybe, like, the last part of my senior year here at Red Oak High School. But um, we kind of came together and started pursuing music um, about six years ago mm -hmm. together. So yeah. we, got, we kind of got serious about it six years ago. Yeah. So before you guys started singing, did you have, like, any uh, singers that were your idols or, like, favorite <laughs> singers, like, you wanted to grow up to be like or anything? Sure, sure. Uh, the light went out. No, I turned it off. Oh, okay. okay. Because it, it it looked like demon eyes, so oh, we're gonna. Okay. <laughs> I kind of figured this was the best. <laughs> <laughs> it's to do this. No, it's still recording. Okay. It's just no flash. Oh, okay. Okay. Can you still okay. See us? Yeah, I can still okay. see you. Okay, cool. That's the question. So, was there any uh, particular singers that were your idols or anything before you started singing? Yeah. Um. <laughs> uh, sorry. Um, the singers. That were my idols. Um, so I really look up to Frank Ocean. Um, I'm a huge fan of John Legend, his vocals. Um, but then also, I mean, more, well, yeah. Uh, Usher, was, I'm a big fan of Usher as well. Um, I liked a lot of rock music, like John Foreman from like Switchfoot, the Goo Dolls, Hidden Rector, those kind of guys. Um, those are probably the friends that I really listened to. Um, probably the most though, uh, it was a band called Reliant K back in the day. I love music and the lyrics. So, so, uh, so how do you guys make uh, music videos? Because I've actually always wanted to try one. I thought maybe I'd get a little help from maybe learning how to. Yeah, so, sure. It's um, a really cool process. Um, so, uh, we kind of take the song that we've already recorded, um, or maybe it's not like mastered, but we take that a song, the version of that song. And uh, we set up some, some speakers actually um, out wherever we're going to be shooting this video at. And we blast that song. And so in the, in the video, it looks like we're actually like, playing the song, but nothing's plugged in. Um, like even the mics aren't even plugged in. Yeah, just we're, just singing, we're just singing to the song yeah. and acting like we're playing. Yeah, right? And we've also worked with, um, as far as like the teams, we got to work with a um, team called Cinderblock. Um, which they do a lot of music videos. They, they record a lot of live music as well. Um, and then we also worked with a, a guy named Reginald Titus Jr. He did our first music video, um, Cinderblock did our, sec our second one. Um, so it's, it's always good to partner with people who you know, have a little bit of experience yeah. and can kind of help like storyboard you know, and help make your vision come to life. So how was y'all's lives in, uh, here in Red Oak High School before you guys became popular? Uh, I was always popular. What you talking about? I don't know. Just kidding. Um, I mean, I'm not. I kind of am. Anyways, um, in high school, I was, it was weird. I was a kid that, like, everybody knew me. Everybody liked me. But I wouldn't say I was popular. Um, because I didn't really go to the parties. It's not like the Peter Parker story, is it? Right, yeah. No, I wasn't a nerd, but I just, you know, I just... <laughs> I just kind of was doing There's pictures of him in high school. No, no, he don't, looks like a nerd. Don't look at those pictures. <laughs> Please don't look at those pictures. Um, I was I was pretty popular in high school. Um, I played sports and I was kind of in everyone's circles and um, I never uh, partake to partook in any bullying or anything like that. Yeah. I was a guy that was just kind of like anywhere I went was fun. I loved to have fun with people and 
create memories, so I knew it wasn't going to last forever. Um, but I was actually all sports in high school. I played basketball, baseball, and football. And um, I had no time for music. <laughs> like, I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't play at all. So um, in, in high school, it was all about you know, going to college to play sports. So. Mm -hmm. right. A bit different these days. All right. And so my last question, do you guys plan on have, doing anything to still be together or be s separate or is anything else you guys have planned for your future of your lives or your career? Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, um, I intend to audition this guy tomorrow. I don't know who this guy is. Okay, come back. We do have an album coming out yes. um, the summer of 2019. And, yeah. um, we're not releasing the name of it just yet, but... After the album, you know, um, a good thing to do after an album is to kind of tour behind it. Mm -hmm. um, so we'll probably be traveling uh, quite a bit at the last half of this year and kind of pushing that album. And um, the idea is to get it in the hands of some people that can really um, put it in front of America. Yeah. Um, so that's that's the goal. And, you know, we just keep chugging, keep chugging along. Yeah, we're able to sign a, uh, just a publishing deal off of our first album, off the single of our first album. Um, and so we're looking to, you know, really, you know, take that to a whole other level, like sign more deals, get a little bit more exposure to them more, just keep growing it, you know. d and is, we want to take it to the end of the earth, so. All right. Well, that'll be it for today, you guys, and thank you once again, d and for making this interview with me. And if you haven't followed them yet, you should follow them on their social medias. They have uh, Twitter and among some others, and... They're just really great guys, and I appreciate you guys once again for even coming here to be in the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's fun. Thanks for having me. Yeah, if you guys can go see them on American's te American Idol, because they got the gold tickets, and they're going to Hollywood. Hollywood, baby! Right. So until then, this is Joe Flash signing off, and Dean and Cheese signing off, and have a good day. Take it easy.